avond tijdens de Cello Biennale is er in het Wimhuis Cello Fest. Dat zijn twee optredens op één avond. En de eerste deze avond is van Chessaba. How do you feel after the performance? Electric. <laughs> That's the first word. I mean, the audience was, was so energetic, you know. We didn't want to leave the stage, but time is time. But we had a great time. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, so just happy joy, you know, and to share music with people and to even learn on stage feels so good, you know, because every time you, you, you keep on learning. So the, the school never ends, really. Yeah. Yeah. What kind of things do you learn on stage then? I think you learn a lot about spontaneity. You learn a lot about... Uh, creating things out of nothing, you know. Uh, and as a cellist, actually, it's, it's a quite a good feeling to have and a, quite a good skill to learn. Uh, an important one that we don't do quite enough, you know. And so when people throw new things at you improvisationally, rhythmically, melodically, you have to be able to be there for it. And so I think for me that was, you know, always, it's always different every time, every time. So that feels amazing. About your, your musical background? Uh, I come from South Africa. I learned uh, the cello in, in Soweto. I started in Soweto at a school called Akosa uh, with an amazing, amazing man uh, who has sadly passed, but his name is Michael Masote and he was the pioneer for, for black young classical musicians. So it was like the cool thing to do. We were so crazy about it. And so I learned the cello there and I live in a place called Sabuke, which is another township. Uh, and so, yeah, I, I, you know, it, it took a bit of time to, to, you know, get an instrument because we didn't have resources and things like that. So little by little, I, I got lucky and, you know, got so fortunate, different people decided to, to add to my life. Uh, buying me a cello, sending me to a better school or things like this and buying me strings, all of these things. And they have culminated into me being here and studying at the Royal Northern College of Music and finishing and just working as a, as a musician who improvises everywhere. It's really a pleasure to be here. We're so elated. And we can be ourselves as cellists. It feels so good. You say it as if it's not always the case. It's not, you know, it's not. I think I think um, there's a, there's some incredible pedagogy which which I totally enjoy, and I still play classical music as much as I can. Um, but also, uh, this idea of, of of improvisation needs to be planted even more within all all of us, you know. And because all of us have such unique voices, it's so different, you know. And the amount of freedom that I've seen around this building is incredible. So I feel like. Uh, you know, even more, I want to go home and strengthen my own voice uh, in this way. So, yeah, viva binale, viva. <laughs>